Hello and welcome back to the Bob Cave. I'm getting ready to talk about my Freight Reads Book Festival uh, signings and just about the day in general. Uh, we're going to get started. First and foremost, I want to take this time and thank my sister Rose. Rose, thank you for the damn tickets for my birthday. I love you, man. All right. <laughs> now that's out of the way. Uh, moving into the event. It was held at the Benfield Sports Center. And starting things off, we got out of my sister's car. And bam, who do we see? Brian O'Halloran. Of course, you may know him uh, from the Clark series. Good old Dante. I'm not even supposed to be here today. Uh, well, my sister Rose, as she's getting out of the car and Dante's walking away, she happened to utter out the classic line from Clark's. Hey, try not to suck any dick on the way through the parking lot. And I do believe he heard it. She, she was pretty loud. <laughs> that being said, before we got into the event, we noticed that they had some vehicles out front. They had the Jurassic Park Jeep, baby. The Ghostbusters hearse. And then, of course, the DeLorean from Back to the Future. Then we head inside and... Uh, do you already know who I wanted to see first and foremost? The one and only Linnea Quigley. Yeah! And we were the first ones there if she arrived at this uh, book festival. And, you know, I'll tell you what, she was very nice, very friendly. She loved my Tar Man t shirt. Uh, we started talking about Return of the Living Dead and how influential it was. and she started talking about animals. I mean, we were having a nice, good chat. Uh, she was very sweet and very engaging. Uh, hell, I wish I could have sat down and had an interview with her or something. Man, I love Linnea Quigley. I've loved her since I was a kid. I told my sister Rose a long time ago, this is the one that I wanted to meet, that I still want to meet, the one and only Linnea. And hey, we didn't get to meet her at a you know horror convention. But hey, meeting her at this book festival was good enough for me, and she was wonderful. Uh, it might be my favorite person I ever met, to be honest. Just how much, uh, I mean, I was talking to her, had a nice conversation, really good time. And then we're going to get into next up, we met the first Jason, good old Arlen Demon. And man, uh, we were at his table waiting, because, you know, Linnea, we were probably there with Linnea about 10 minutes, and... Hey, Ari was right next to Linnea. So we were waiting at the table about 10 minutes. Maybe not 10, let's say 5. And as we're going to leave, we see Ari coming down. So we all turn back around and go back. And he sees that we're waiting for him. And my little nephew Aiden happened to be wearing a Jason mask. And uh, Ari fist bumped us all and started talking to us about Friday the 13th and swimming. And he was just very engaging and very fun. Uh, very lighthearted, and I tell you what, he was very, very cool, and I appreciate the way he was with my nephew, he's very good with him, and all in all, I mean, he told us about his rock band, I got an autograph from him and Linnea, after having the initial story with Brian O'Halloran, uh, meeting Linnea, I mean, meeting Linnea alone was worth it, in my opinion, but meeting Ari Lehman, I mean, it was a great event, a great time. Lots of books if you're into reading. Lots of different kinds of books if you're into reading. And not only books, they sell coffee, t-shirts, you name it. They got it in there, some DVDs. Maybe on a smaller scale, but still got to meet Linnea. Tonight. Thank you again, Rose. I love you. Yeah!